Hi all, welcome back to my channel. So uh, this is my first ever uh, video after a long gap. I was missing in action basically uh, because I had a lot of things to take care of apart from being so on social media. So what I decided was that my last video was uh, giving an, uh, in, in, giving an um, overview of what it is like to get settled uh, in Canada. Uh, and it's been seven months now. I've been uh, in, in, in a different country uh, apart from my home country. And uh, I would like to touch base with uh, all you all of you guys to show that what's the realistic viewpoint of being in Canada. And so that people who are willing to or aspiring to move in this country uh, will be prepared on what to expect. So let's get started. So the first and foremost thing is um, I might have already mentioned this is my previous video is Whenever you move to a different country uh, or uh, be it Canada, US, Germany, Australia, uh, be it any any different country, when you move from your home country to another country, there is always a mental challenges that you'll have to face. Uh, some, some of you guys might travel alone, some of you guys might travel with your family, your partner or your kids uh, and but at the end of the day it's all uh, depends on your mental strength or attitude towards the uh, the challenges that you have to face so in my case i traveled all alone and um, i had no friends uh, just couple of mutual friends that i know of through linkedin uh, no family members in canada so it was kind of a big struggle for me to uh, to feel included into this community um, and since i traveled during winter i i was in a situation where i couldn't move out because of the terrible winter in Toronto and uh, there had been situations where I felt very uh, depressed and wanted to go back to India. So I was also in a situation where I felt did I take the right choice of moving uh, to a different country and leaving my stable job and a comfortable life that I had in, back in India. And uh, so eventually I did try to move uh, uh, out of that situation, a mental situation by uh, doing a couple of things like uh, uh, reading books that's one of my hobby so I started reading books enrolled into uh, different uh, volunteer opportunities so that I could talk to people understand what they where they come from different walks of life experiences so doing all all those things helped me to open up uh, to different people and also gave me an uh, understanding like okay i'm not the only person who's struggling there is also there is always a struggle factor for all the immigrants who are moving and finding a place to in a different country so the first and foremost uh, the first and foremost thing everyone has to understand is your mental strength is very important and uh, this is the time where your mental strength is also is questioned uh, so uh, to, to be honest if you are strong enough to take this challenge then I, I feel that uh, moving to different country is always for you and uh, yeah so that's the first point uh, the second point is to understand the realistic expect to have a realistic expectations of moving to Canada so uh, let's say for example I feel Canada has been the most uh, top destination for immigrants right now a lot of young educated talents coming in either as a student or as a as in a work permit or open permit or PR like me so the number one expectations that you have to have is it's never easy to settle the first few months or the first first one year of being an immigrant um, if you if you think that you can leave your stable job and then come to Canada you will get an equivalent job as in what you had in India and start making income I would be the uh, you would hate me to tell that it's totally wrong you might be in a situation where you have to bit go below your uh, experiences because there are plenty of people coming in India and let's say all of them are educated everyone are educated nobody you cannot say that I'm more educated than the other person because everyone are talented coming from India and everyone wants to get the equivalent job or the job that they deserve right so uh, and there are only so much that the Canadian company uh, the companies here could offer so and they always prefer the Canadian experience talent not the people who come from uh, different uh, experiences so for example uh, i i worked in indian in companies um american companies in india 
although i have worked in couple of big companies the experiences were tied within india right so they always made they always were looking for only canadian experience so that's the huge caveat when getting a job in canada so they only expect people who have had experiences working in canadian company or at least had the exposure of working in canada that, than having any other experiences so the struggle is real in terms of getting a job in canada and the second most important part is it's also very difficult to get a, jo- a part time job or any other job for that matter uh, when i was in job search i was also looking for part time because you need your money you need money to survive right so i see people are kind of tra- taking up different jobs irrespective of uh, their education and that is all to because they want to survive they want money to survive to keep them uh, in canada so the realistic view point is that it is if you have a expectation that you can find a job easily and 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 a similar job that you have had in india i would say that uh, please understand that there are couple of struggles and uh, also try to try to come in an attitude that okay there are struggles i understand there are struggles but i can fight it out find a better job and try to merge into this community so if you have that uh, mindset within yourself i'm sure you can survive and you can come out with being a successful immigrant or a successful uh, canadian for that matter so that's the 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 most realistic expectation everyone has to have and now that i've al- already mentioned the most important point uh, uh, that i wanted to convey through this message the third th- talk to different people so this is this was very difficult for me because um, basically i don't uh, have energy to um, talk to different people maybe i i i'm kind of bit shy and uh, so but that that is not a reason for me to step stay back if i had to get a job and settle faster i have to i should be in a place where i should stop being an introvert and be an extrovert so there are there were certain situations where i, I had to be an extrovert talk to different people irrespective of their cultures and understand where they are coming from so linkedin was one platform that allowed me to talk to different people and i must say people are willing to help you i have had different bitter bitter experiences where couple of people were rude to me saying that i do not have a canadian experience or so so um apart from those experiences majority of people were willing to help me out on getting a job they were willing to at least give me their advices so my point is that basically to talk to different people just don't stay at indoors uh, stay indoors and uh, talk to different people understand what different experiences they've had uh, what would they advise because only when from when, only from failure you get to learn out learn understand what different techniques or tricks that you can do so uh, talking to different people uh, gelling with different cultures uh, not just indian uh, members but also different cultures different uh, people from different backgrounds uh, will help you a lot in understanding what should be done in order to for you to get a job and the last thing is to uh, tell you that I, i must say this place is a place for the strongest because um i have had seen people moving dif- uh, moving back to india uh, there are several videos circling out saying that people from canada are moving to india back all everybody have their own reasons maybe they wanted uh, they they their expectations were different maybe they were well very well settled back in india or they have ha- they might have had different uh, situations that they have to be in india so i'm i'm no way going to judge anybody but the point here is that struggle is definitely there uh, but if you can survive that struggle that period of struggle this place gives you tremendous opportunity guys i i must say you i must tell to everyone canada or any other different countries or uh, the countries that you are aspiring to emigrate they they have a certain challenges but if you can only fight those challenges and come out uh, you can definitely see the benefits out of it towards the end i would like to say that uh if you if at all you are in a situation of struggle right now in in any country be it canada germany australia or us for that matter never never lose your hope 
try to fight it out um, try to sustain the sustain throughout the journey and come out of it when you come out of it i'm sure you are going to find yourself strong mentally and your ability and uh, and all these struggles will not go in vain because you will be much more mature uh, in your life and also find yourself that you are ready to take on any different challenges that come into your life so uh, my final advice to everyone is to um, have hope do not lose hope have confidence and i have huge respect to people who are moving to a different country and leaving their life behind and restarting their whole life it's never easy to restart the whole life from an insider perspective i must say i have a huge respect to people who have been uh, fighting and coming out of the challenges um, uh, please uh, understand that uh, these are all going to end very soon and you will look back and find yourself that you have become more stronger more mature uh, throughout this whole journey so that's all for this video guys hope this video was useful to every one of you if you feel this video is kind of helpful giving you some positive energy please do like share and subscribe i will keep you along with my journey as being a canadian immigrant bye